Microinjection is a widely used technique to introduce macromolecules such as DNA, RNA, morpholinos, proteins, dyes or even drugs into a selected cell at a chosen stage of an embryo during early development. Here in this session, we show the procedure to inject H2B mcherry mRNA into a one cell stage em zebrafish embryo in order to label the cell nuclei of the developing embryo. The histone 2B sequence fused with the mcherry fluorescent protein labels the chromatin in red in all cell nuclei. We use femtojet injector from Ependorf which uses air pressure to deliver the macromolecule filled in the glass needle into the embryo. Warmed 1.5 percentage agarose in embryo medium containing methylene blue is poured in a 10 cm petri dish and a plexiglass mold is applied on top of the agarose to allow the formation of grooves where the embryos will be lined up. When agarose has solidified at room temperature, remove the comb and add embryo medium. Injection plates can be stored at 4 degrees Celsius for 2 to 3 weeks. A glass capillary is pulled on a vertical pipette puller. Parameters such as heat intensity and pulling force must be adjusted to get a needle with a narrow extremity with internal diameter of 1 nanometer. Needles are stored in a box by sticking them on modeling clay to prevent tip breakage and dust contamination. RNA is synthesized using an MSH M machine transcription kit then diluted in water to 100 nanogram per microliter and stored in aliquots of 10 microliter at minus 80 degrees Celsius. Fertilized eggs are collected shortly after spawning to allow microinjection at the one cell stage. Embryos are lined up in the narrow grooves of the injection plate with the cell position on top or slightly lateral using forceps. An injection capillary is filled up with 3 microliter of H2B M cherry mRNA using a 20 microliter microloader tip slowly without letting any bubbles in. The needle is then installed into the holder of a micro injector and is positioned at around 30 to 60 degree angle to the embryo to facilitate smooth penetration into the embryo. The needle tip is opened by cutting it diagonally at the very end using clean and fine tweezers before starting micro injection. A volume of about 3 nanoliter of RNA is injected into a one cell stage embryo. The injected volume is roughly estimated visually by referring to this schematic. Injection pressure on the micro injector is adjusted according to the volume needs to be injected. Usually the compensation pressure is kept constant. Injection is done one by one into the center of the cell either by pressing inject button on the injector or using the pedal attached to the injector. In order to allow ubiquitous and homogeneous expression of H2B M cherry fusion protein in all cells of the embryo, microinjection is performed at the one cell stage. The cell division appears 20 minutes after fertilization, thus all embryos must be injected in less than 20 minutes. After microinjection, the embryos are transferred to a new petri dish containing embryo medium and incubated at 28.5 degrees Celsius. At the 3 hour post fertilization stage, embryos are screened for M cherry expression using a fluorescent stereo microscope through an RFP filter. Embryos exhibiting a strong and homogeneous staining are selected for live imaging experiments. 